Thank you, Mwono Asante Sana. Mze wetu wana muriuki gatata watoto wetu wa mama ya kero gashagwa kimata ya gudhie murigo atoshushu na toshukuru kaneda wito wa machakaya ma governor ito ode ma senator abuge ode mcs adwa itura riri ya mirera na adwa laikipia na adwa nyiri na ode mokete gaide mwega na hede sio ode gaidia ishare la mwadha ni agosho mwadha ni agosho rege kanida ndani ha bere yake gogona na dati ya maguta na mimi niseme asante sana kwa wale wote wamefika hapa kwa familia yetu kumsidikisha huyu my sister mwalimu Lea wa Angari the eldest child in the family ya Nashon Gashagwari Riani na Lydia Nyagodhi a big family by this was our elder sister na when my father and our mothers died tuliwachiwa huyu mama na dia amekuwa akituongoza kama familia na ametupeleka vizuri sana she has put us together as a family na kutufundisha sana kumwogopa Mwenyezi Mungu she has created unity within our family and put god first and amekuwa tegemeo kubwa sana kwa uongozi wangu kwa maombi na mawaidha so as i sit here today to escort her the gap ametuachia ni kubwa na mungu atatusaidia mzee and your children again i want to say pole i know how you feel words of comfort from me and the rest of us are not enough because of the gap of this matriarch who was a pillar not just of your family but our larger family and my children i want to assure you that i'm there for you my home is your home any day you are welcome and the gap that has been left by your mother will be there to do whatever that we need to do to make sure that you are comfortable and you are able to proceed on with the life even in the absence of our mother for we as a family I want to ask people to pray for us it's been a very difficult time for my family within a short span We've lost very many people. We were 13 children, I think five now with her gone. So we are eight. Our father and our mothers are gone. So Kevara Johnson, where are you, my brother? Please lead us now. Uh, take over from where Leah has left. You are the eldest. Unite us and guide us through keep us together the way our sister has done where you know where papa you to utunyitidanie tuchokadelie utuiguidanie nagala family to erogame a great teacher teacher i didn't know gire your files are everywhere that is true teachers make a great mark in society and this is a great teacher she has taught many people the while here giving testimony and that is the way life should be when you are given an opportunity to serve do your very best and leave a mark 
so that a day like today, your achievements can be talked about the way we are doing with Leah. A great woman of faith, a great teacher, a mother, and a great leader of our family. So, teacher Irene, I have heard you about that road. Between me and governor, consider it done. Iyo tutafanya. Iyo, iyo, dogadi rege na kovo kovo. Mada wovira ulezi jaga na tadi tadiwe. Iyo gedi mo do ni to no wale damu no. Ginya ginya tuwa shonoka. Ati mi akewe mo do no wale damu no. I I want to say between myself and the governor here, we will we'll work on that road so that uh, that matter is settled. Uh, when I was here yesterday, the rocket machakaya to go kudi mushi, the giyoki the tamugeni to the kirimugeni, na kanida na kamete yawa iguan na governor na deputy governor na duwa the dumusho kiriye gado. The kuni itri na itari kuo to the wero shumura ruti na wakwa. Nindi lagu no koro koko ge faga mati koko ge heri ya koko ge kama odo mara magi meka koko the ino wa mushi ne mwe ne mushi. No to duwa wera wakwa mura ni itri na itri na wusho kiriye gado shia mwanya. I don't take it for granted that uh, you are here to hold forth for us and to make sure the home is warm and to receive visitors on our behalf when we are away. I want to say thank you. The other one could roll your today's shukuru yo wa merera primary kulea lea wa midagia na ne idrafa gire istrikari ne kohe ala shiriki miro ni datu na gata to doda ke to doda ke iradi shio Again, the little village in Oeta Wokaduma Namurajira to Kigari to Lute Duma Wokonugo Gogu and Edrava Gidan and Ivagate, the Tokona scheme Yakum Kira di Timaitura de Negata to Lute Duma. Now you cast it to Tafaya Niki Malizia was a Babu Sitaki was a Mengi. Great County of Laikipia, Rais na mimi tulipata kura mingi sana. Na kuna ahadi tulitoa wakati ya uchaguzi. Na mimi mwenyewe diyo nilikuwa hapa kwa niyaba ya Rais. Na nikafanya economic forum pale nya hururu na tukakubaliana ya kwamba tukichukua na fasi ya uongozi. Mwenyezi mungu akituonekania kupitia mikono yenu. Kuna mambo katha tutafanya na tumefanya. Ya kwanza ilikuwa ni mambo ya usalama. Na mimi mwenyewe nilipeana hiyo ahadi kwa niyaba ya rais. Na kati ya mimi na rais, tumehakikisha ya kwamba usalama umedumishu wa laikipia. Hivi juzi tu tuliongeza NPR 250 na kulikuwa na wengine. Na mulio alisasi umetulia. Na itakaa na mna hiyo. Inataka nipeana ya ahadi kwa niyaba ya rais, serikali yetu. The county commissioner and his team, they have done a very good job. And I really want to commend them. Tuendele kulida wananchi wa laikipia wakai kwa amani. Kila mutu wapata na fasi ya kujitafutia riziki. Bila watu kupigwa risasi na watu kusunguliwa. Na tutaendelea kutumisha usalama katika county yetu ya laikipia. Again, tulipea na ahadi mambo ya watu kusunguliwa na ndovu. Na wanyama wengine wapori kufamia mimea ya wakaji wa laikipia. Munajua tulikuwa na raisi. Pale la Kipia West, na ile uwa fence, electric fence inaendelea. Diyo wanyama wa mstuni, wakaya mstuni, na wanainchi wakaya kwa mashamba, tuwe shimiane. Kwa sababu wanyama, walikuwa na vuna pahali wajapanda. Tumambia wakaya kwa miti, wakule nyasi, na ile vitu vigine naesa patikana mstuni. Mambo ya mahiri na maharagwe wa achie sisi hiyo ni yetu. Na hiyo tumekubaliana. And that is going on. Mambo ya barabara ya kutoka area nyanyuki kwenda rumuruti is on course. Mambo imekuwa ngumu, lakini as things are improving, that is another commitment we shall honor. Among many others, mambo ya buahol, mambo ya dams, tutaendelea. Sitaki nionge sana, nitarudi tuoge mambo ya maendeleo, lakini county yetu tumeshikiria vile inatakikana. Mambo ya madawa za kulevia, na pombe haramu ya kuwa watu, munajua tumefanya juhudi. Hiyo ni kazi raisa linipatia niongoze, and I'm happy. 
ya kwamba hapa na kipia hapo sasa have done a good job kanisa pia mtusaidie kwa mambo ya rehabilitation ya wale wamekuwa addicted to kinge vijana wetu kutoka kwa hii mambo ya mihadarati na zile pombe ambazo zinaua watu ani drake na ni utodo kumana kemati ka ukoma mitaro na ukoma rugwa itanda ni unedraji ya kuona ni kuragira yuko ngona farande no nati mia mekirita kufura no kona maria tugu harini ukamanya ni kwega kamanya ni kwega atoreda aduli na atimia maikarania wega nigetha tugie na ciara tone kirathimo nitiguo na ciara nyingi ni kindu kiega kindu kiuruke nene no ki oke roda reda ru ana ke na atimia tuongerere ruriri nigetha ngi ukadi theba guku Kaiwa nonge itura leu nonge nonge kamanya nega kamanya tuira ini ini to dunu e gatulia igi tiuru no e gatulia igi joke juge giri kia muhujia neuga e na kana kana fast class onas e alo kalenda kuthi Kenya School of Law akaga besha cia uthoma atono ndari ukano akijira kaudi ngire muningo kuera ndigathombithie nagetha agatwe kawakiri goke karute wira is something i can do ni to kwa details nagetha ndigatware shukuru tohote kugateithia niki malizia let me say that our country faces difficult moments and as a deputy president as a leader of this country i want to call for peace and calm i want to say that this is our own country we have no other country and i want to ask the people of kenya to make peace observe peace and keep away from violence the young generation gen z as your father my sons and daughters we have heard you you spoken very clearly the message is home what you started as peaceful protests unfortunately have been infiltrated and hijacked by criminals with a criminal intent who are now engaged in looting and creating mayhem i want to as a father as a parent to appeal to my children my sons and daughters listen to us as your parents i think if you agree we want to plead with you to call off the protests so that criminals do not hijack them and engage in criminal activities the president has already acceded to your plea to be heard and you will be heard but any time now you call for protests criminals with bad intent are hijacking and using that opportunity to loot to steal and to cause mayhem as our children you owe this country peace please consider now that you have been heard don't allow these criminals an opportunity to take advantage of what you had started in good faith with a message to the country infiltrate and hijack and bring chaos to our beautiful country that is my plea as a parent to my children and i want to say that now that you have been heard a mechanism is being worked on on how the issues that you think needs to be addressed will be addressed once you call over your protests then our security agencies will be in a position to deal firmly and decisively with criminals in accordance with the laws of this country i want to ask our leaders the way they have started here it's a good beginning let's tone down let us bring down temperatures let us all build our country we have only one country with one leader let us embark on peaceful coexistence among people so that 
we enjoy the fruits of our labor. A situation of chaos and mayhem is not conducive for people to carry on with their lives. That is my plea to all leaders in the country. It's my plea to our younger generation. It's my plea to everybody to understand and appreciate that we don't have another Kenya, we only have one Kenya. And we all must do what we should to make sure that there is peace and harmony in the country so that we are able to lead a good life. I want to thank my boss, President William Ruto, who has sent me with condolences to our family. And I also thank him for the support that he has given us in terms of solidarity, in terms of financial support. He has stood with us like a brother. He has always stood with my family at all times when we face difficulties. And he has sent me to read his condolence, which I will. Condolence message from His Excellency William Ruto, President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander-in-Chief of Kenya Defense Forces to the family and friends of the late Mamalea Wangari Morioki. Our country has lost a respected and hard-working woman. Mamalea Wangari Murioki was progressive, responsible, and caring. She was a selfless and devoid figure who served the community with distinction. Mama Wangari was abundant in fresh ideas and thoughts that transformed the lives of many people that she taught. She was a prayerful philanthropist, industrious agripreneur, and a great lover of education. Her determination and focus in life will continue to inspire many generations to come. Today, I join the family through my deputy, Rigadi Gashagwa, the people of Nyeri and Lekipia counties, in honoring a woman whose light will never fade. May we be uplifted by the word of the Lord in Psalms 46, verse 1. And I quote, God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. Rest in peace. Mama Wangari, signed William Samoy Ruto. PND Rice McCoffee. Uh,